Welcome everyone to our Thursday recap. I am Ray. Pastor New here. Welcome. Love to see everybody tuning in. And definitely, today we're definitely. going to dive right into yeah, it. Yeah, let's do but it. But before we do that, you've been you've been working out. Yes, I've been working getting out some a clients. lot. Yes, I am a personal trainer now at Johnny O's Gymnasium, so it's been awesome. going really good. Awesome. Yeah, and absolutely. And you're training love some it. celebrities, and you don't have to mention names because that's yeah, like I'm not going to mention names. Yeah, <laughs> that's private. Yeah, information. but it's, it's going well. God has given me some really great opportunities. Always yeah. thankful. And just giving him the glory. Awesome. Like and you trained Gen- Genesis came to the workout. Yes, right? yes. I Genesis you, like, came into our Wednesday class. Uh, it was absolutely awesome. I heard awesome. you worked her really good. Yes. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think it was a love-hate relationship we have now. Yeah. Working out, but it's always a love-hate relationship. It, it's always a love-hate relationship. Yeah. Like, you love it but when it you're so good. done. Yeah. But when you're actually doing it. Yeah, not so much. Not, not so much. Not as That's much. Right. So let's dive very yeah, into, let's our get into re- it. Uh, to our Thursday recap. Go ahead. Definitely. This past Sunday. So this past Sunday, we focused on Joshua 1, um, 7 through 9. And the first thing that our wonderful pastor you mentioned that really Appreciate stuck out it. to me was that we have to have a tunnel vision when following God. Don't a, look. Don't look left right. and don't look right. That's right. Don't Keep look. our focus on God. On God. A lot of times in life, we have so many distractions that turns our head yep. away from our Lord. Yep. But <laughs> we have to learn how to have tunnel vision. And honestly, we have to have the discipline within our lives to keep that tunnel vision and keep our focus on God. Kind of like working out. God. Yes, kind of like working out. You have to have the discipline to just show up and go at it every morning. That's right. Even though it's hard and even though you don't want to, That's you right. got to keep your eyes focused on the goal. You see, you see how when <laughs> you, you see what, the connection. Yeah, but you see how when 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 the scripture applied to something that you're passionate about, it just kind of flows. It does flow. Like, it's it, it really, it you, really this, does yeah, flow. This right. is not planned, by the way. <laughs> it's, like, it's never planned. So, anyway, <laughs> <laughs> all right. So, go ahead. Roll so, right along. Be strong, I courageous. Wanna, go ahead. Yes, and I want to read part of Joshua one through seven. Go ahead. So it says, uh, have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged for the love for for the Lord. Your God will be with you wherever you go. Mm-hmm. And so that was very insurance assurance because right. it was, you know, sometimes in life we let our worries, anxieties and fear get the best of us. That's and right. we tend to forget that we have the Lord literally at our side. Right. So this Sunday, I want to illustrate on what the Lord, your God, really means. Ooh, I'm excited. It's really, it's I'm re- excited. It has three different meanings to it, and all three plays into that role. So Ooh, a little sneak peek it's to no Sunday. Peak this Sunday. I That's like right. It. That's right. This is why you have to tune into our Thursday recaps. <laughs> well, but this Sunday. This Sunday. This yeah. is why you have to tune into right. Sunday. Thursday to recap our... is recapping the sermon. I know. Oh, but the but when you peak. turn into the Thursday recaps, you kind of get, get a sneak, sneak peek. peek. Ah, yeah. I like it. I like it. <laughs> um, but then <laughs> we talked about how God is fighting our battles. Mm-hmm. And sometimes we don't even realize it either. It, it's just like I was going through some stuff a few weeks ago. I remember praying to God and I didn't realize how much worse the situation could have been. And I looked at it and I looked at everything that could have happened or would have happened. Right. And how God was just really helping me fight my yeah. battles that I was dealing with. And other people were praying for you too. No, exactly. Like Pastor New. Yes, like, like Pastor checking in news. on you. Like, <laughs> how are you feeling? You need to sleep. Yes, shoot. exactly. <laughs> you need so, to rest. And then um, lastly, I wrote down that your faith is in his power and your hope is in his promises. Oh, you and remember that part. I huh? do remember That's that so part. Good. I know it sounds like an Instagram quote a little bit. It is. It is. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but I personally really liked yeah, it. Yeah. Um, but your faith is in his power and your, your hope, hope is in his promises. I really, I really, really like that. That was probably the part yeah. that really stuck out to me. Yeah. Um, but just overall, just the message was very uplifting and encouraging. Mm. I also wrote down a. Um, this is something you also had in your um, message, but the encouragement, the the encouragement to be strong and courageous is not about the opposition, but it's about them. <laughs> sorry, looking right and left, forgetting the one true God. That's right. And we see that all the time nowadays. We forget right. that God 
is the one in power. He's right, the one right. controlling. Like we're afraid of what's ahead. No, exactly. But the truth is what we're really distracted is that we forget that we are directed by God. Exactly. So when we look right, exactly. we look So the fear, the real fear, I want to touch on that a second. Yeah, the real fear, it's not what's out there. Mm-hmm. The real fear of being strong and courageous, it's what? Is in here. It's in here. Ooh. That we, the one that looked right and left. Not the promises of God. His yeah. promises do the same. Yeah. Cool, huh? That's very Instagram cool. post. That is definitely Instagram worthy. That yeah. is definitely Instagram worthy. <laughs> Anything else? Any encouragement before um, we go? Just remember, God is fighting your battles. Be okay. strong and courageous. And he'll don't be, look right. Don't, don't look left. Exactly. Your don't. faith, it's in his power. Keep. And your hope, it's in. His promises. That's right. And you know that already. Yes. Welcome I- and thank you for tuning in to <laughs> yes. Thursday Recap. Thank you, everyone, for tuning in to our Thursday Recap. That's right. We'll Again, see you Sunday. Pastor New. Ray. Ray. Farewell, everyone. Peace.